know, I fell in love with the city. I want to do everything I can to help this city out and be there for the city. And it's just a free feeling. Um, going out there and knowing that this team trusts me. They believe in me. And, you know, now it's time for me to just go out there and have fun and let, let my talent go. I'm Darwin Zook with the MLB.com FastCast. The Cardinals have agreed to a five-year extension with 25-year-old Colton Wong. It's a deal that will buy out all three of Wong's arbitration years, plus a year of free agency. The contract also includes a club option, which if exercised, would keep the homegrown second baseman under contract until after the 2021 season. I felt great. It's just it's the biggest step, biggest step being out there and you know, having fun, man, again, uh, competing, you know. I missed out a lot of the offseason, and you know, it's happy that I get to do that again. Jose Fernandez was dominant in an intra-squad game on Wednesday. The Marlins ace breezed through two scoreless innings, striking out five. Fernandez is set to make his Grapefruit League debut on Monday versus the Nationals. Malik Smith tripled twice in the Braves' seven-run first inning and later homered to pace the Braves to an 11-4 win over the Orioles. O's slugger Chris Davis added a solo shot in the loss. 3-1 delivery, Davis sends a fly ball out toward right center. Pretty well hit. Way back is Smith. Way back there. Wait it. Bye-bye, the big fella. Yes, indeed. He launched it. And a ball that just missed the scoreboard out there in right center. That ball got airborne and just never came down. Yankee starter Luis Severino struggled in his spring debut, allowing five earned runs over an inning and a third, including a grand slam to Brian Holiday. But the Bronx Bombers were able to erase a seven-run deficit on a walk-off error in the ninth for a 10-9 win over the Tigers' split squad. New Yankee Starlin Castro and Aaron Hicks both drove in runs in the victory. In the Tigers' other split squad game against the Pirates, University of Michigan head football coach Jim Harbaugh took some time off from the recruiting trail to coach first base. The Tigers kept Harbaugh busy with plenty of base runners rolling to a 10-3 win. Jeff Samarja hurled two innings of one-run ball in his Giants spring debut as San Francisco beat the Angels 4-1. Jose Ramirez hit his first homer of the spring, and Cody Anderson tossed two scoreless innings in his start as the Indians and the Reds played to a 4-4 tie. For more on these stories and all your latest spring training news, keep it locked in to MLB.com. It's baseball everywhere.